How is everybody out there? Super bummed that I uh, thought I'd just film this video and I didn't. But uh, I got seven packs of the Bowman First Edition. Um, just wanted to get my hands on some of these and see what they were like. They're super, super expensive, but uh, I did pretty well. I got a Jordan Balasovich. That's the, these are the non numbered. Um, they're like the chrome, they're not chrome, they're still paper, but they're a foil. Luis Robert, Taylor Trammell, Alec Baum, and another first of Nico Holseer, who was round 18. But this is what the base card looks like. Pretty simple. Um, I'll have to go through this stack and see if any of these guys were high picks that are the Bowman firsts. But uh, I bought seven packs. I paid a pretty, pretty nice penny. Um, but obviously, did come across one of these. This is the card everybody was looking for. Looks like it's a little off center to the right, but PSA might not ding me too bad on that. So Jason Dominguez was a 2019 signing as a free agent. I'm pretty sure everybody knows about him. I think he signed at 17 or 18. Might even been younger than that. I uh, was lucky enough to score Bobby Witt Jr. as well, so uh, two for two. Um, then another one here that's a PC card for me is Jaron Duran. Uh, he's a Red Sox outfielder. Had an amazing showing last year in spring training, and I thought he potentially could be a September call-up, but uh, he wasn't. He was a round seven 2018 pick, but uh, he's had a great showing in uh, AAA. And then I did get one color. I got the uh, Canary Yellow of Byron Lawyer, Laura first. Looks like he was a... Uh, Rangers 2019 free agent signing. Not totally sure his story. I'll look it up and uh, kind of see if he's how he is. But uh, like I said, seven packs. There were 15 a pack when they came out. Had a lot of the typical names in here that you've seen in Bowman already. But uh, like Tarek Skubal, um, a lot of these guys, this is their chance at the Bowman first because Bowman kept getting bumped back. But uh, yeah, a lot of firsts in here. And then there's some from last year, like CJ Abrams. He was sixth overall last year. Um, Libertor, who everybody's seen in all of them. Jordan Groshans, I have his autograph from when that came out. Uh, Christian Pash, um, Mackenzie Gore, Ulrich Bozharski, free agent, sounds like he's an international free agent signing. Jackson Rutledge, uh, Joe Ryan. If you guys want to get these, they are spiking hard in price uh, because of that Dominguez. I got my money back in this. Wilfred Astadio, who I think must be Willens Astadio's cousin or brother or son, I don't know. Um, but yeah. They're nice cards. The paper stock is pretty nice. Um, they're they're pretty thick. Resigns was round two, 49th overall. But yeah, I bought seven packs. I want to say I paid 200 plus. But the uh, thing is, I got it all back in that. So it'll go to grade. Uh, nice card for any Yankees fans out there. Uh, Jason Dominguez, J-A-S-S-O-N. But uh, got that. And I think that one's doing around 35 to 40. Um, these are rare. They're worth putting your hands on if you can. But... Uh, I decided I think for 350 guys I'm gonna do my best to either get uh, either a boombox, uh, high end, or a platinum for the winner, or I maybe I'll do a nuclear bomb pack, or if I can get my hands on them I'd like to do an all about the hobby, but we will see. So I appreciate everyone tuning in. Stay safe out there. Later on today I'll be breaking a Brooklyn collection uh, from Tops 582, and I'll be doing a BGS reveal. So. Appreciate everyone. Thanks for tuning in. I know this is short. I thought I filmed the video and of course found out that I didn't. So thanks for tuning in and uh, congrats to uh, Big Mike out there for one year on YouTube. All right.